uh, the Civil Rights Law of 1964 prohibits children from being placed by public welfare departments into non-integrated institutions. That's the area in which we're having the, the difficulty. How will this affect you all then? What will happen to these children? Well, now, of these children, uh, first of all, we are not asking that these children leave. We're not going to evict these children. Our doors are open for these children and for other such children. We're here to give a service. Now, if the Departments of Public Welfare feel uh, they must move the children, then that's going to be their decision. I think that it would adversely affect many of these children to move them from our institution. And I, I really believe it's real poor child welfare uh, for a, a department to even consider such a move without considering the effect on the kids. In light of this, do you see uh, the Baptist Children's Home here becoming an integrated institution? Not at all. We have uh, in care right now some 380 children. Uh, that is in our institutional care and in our boarding home program and in our adoptive care and in our family aid program. Uh, this then affects some, I uh, say, one-sixth of the total program of the uh, children's home. So uh, we feel that as long as we are supported by the Southern Baptist Churches of Virginia, then we are responsible to them and to uh, their people. Therefore, uh, all the churches are white churches, and all the children are white children from these churches. Therefore, there's no purpose in our becoming an integrated institution. We don't have any Negro constituents. 